Hey, what's going on everybody? Welcome back to Market Martians. If you're new here, my name is Austin, and this is the Market Martians Stock Trading Channel. Uh, we also have a Discord for Market Martians. I'm going to be putting that in the description down below. It's free to join. We have about 4,000 members in there, and we offer some paid memberships as well to teach you guys about tra trading, and we give you some day trade alerts, some options, all kinds of stuff. So come check it out, see what it's all about. Uh, today we're going to be talking about XELA, uh, XLA Technologies. And I'm not a financial advisor, but this is going to be my technical analysis on this. I'm going to show you guys where I think this is heading in the near future. So if you uh, like this video, please drop a like and subscribe. I'm trying to get 300 subscribers soon, so help me reach my goal. Okay, XCLA. We covered this a couple days ago, but let's see how the price action is doing now. Keep an eye on this one for a potential breakout again. So it did break $2.30, which I think is a very crucial target for us, especially for you swing traders out there. I think that um, if we can close up to $2.30 today, tomorrow we could see a possible run to $3. If we close below $2.30, I'm not very bullish on this until it does do that. Um, I think it does need to close above $2.30 for us to see a possible run up. And if it does, we could see $3. Okay, uh, support is a dollar and eighty cents. Uh, we fall below that. Who knows where we're going? Probably down to a dollar sixty or lower. Uh, definitely want to hold that. Not buying in that area. Only buying this for a swing if we close above two dollars and thirty cents, which is our main resistance line right here. And we did break that. We ran up to about two dollars and forty cents today. Um, but now we're coming back down to two twenty one. So keep an eye on this for the end of the day. If you want to try to take a risk on this for tomorrow, that's up to you. I'd say it's about a four out of five on the risk scale. So however you want to handle that, I think there's a possible uh, chance for a gain tomorrow. Um, if closed below two dollars and thirty cents, I see this coming back to two dollars and it's hanging out there for a while. But overall, for uh, you know the kind of midterm, what we want to see is it to break out of this channel right here. Um, now, we kind of want to just keep uh, pounding through here uh, between $2 and $2.30 and start creating some higher lows, which we kind of are doing, but I can't say that because we did drop all the way down to $1.27 on June 21st after a pump to about $2. So we don't want to get rejected by the $2 point. We, that's why we kind of want to hang up here around this $2.30. So I'm um, going to close above that today. Could start us running up to my first target of $3.20. And then after that, um, you know, if bullish continuation continues, we could see $4 in the near future or, you know, $6 was in March. I don't know if that's going to happen. Um, it did go all the way from $1.60. Um, the chart, I wouldn't say it's a rep, it's a, you know, doing the exact same thing it did, but, you know, it kind of is lining up to pop another possible pump in the very near future. So I, I would suggest throwing this on your watch list, no doubt. Um, like I said, just follow the targets I have set up. Uh, be very careful trading this. You don't want to be bag holding this one. Trust me, because it could come down to a dollar twenty-seven, and if you buy up here two dollars and thirty cents, that's a fat loss for you. Don't be caught holding the bag. Set your stop losses. Uh, you know, set up a plan for yourself. You're going to buy at this point, sell at this point, and a stop loss where you take your losses at. Um, one last time, we really need to close above two dollars and thirty cents today. I cannot emphasize that enough. I really think that makes me bullish for tomorrow and the rest of the week. So let's hope for a close above that. If not, I'm not touching this at all. Staying away. If you like this video, please drop a like and subscribe and feel free to comment below a stock you would like me to cover next. Hope you all have a great day. Make sure to check out the Discord also.